Before we get into the video, I need you guys to do me a favour. Number one, get this video to at least 200 likes. Also comment, let me know your thoughts on the case. Now please let me know whether you agree or disagree. A TV fraud gang that consisted of five people were found guilty for illegally offering customers the ability to stream Premier League games and other football matches around the world. Thousands of blockbuster movies and TV shows also for the very convenient price of a tenner a month. Now the gang that was headed up by Mark Gold was said to have generated more than £7 million. That was enough money for the men to live a very comfortable life. Now the business was booming. Mark Gold and his mates Stephen Gordon, Peter Jolly, William Brown, Christopher Falvez as well as Zach Smith who decided not to turn up for sentencing and instead go on the run who is currently MIA had over 30 employees on their payroll, even a person who had expertise in anti-piracy. The guy was a specialist. When William Brown was actually arrested by police, he was audacious. He claimed he was actually working undercover, acting in the interest of law enforcement agencies. Now, when police asked which agency he worked for in question, William stumbled. However, evidence showed that William Brown was the anti-piracy specialist who was able to hack into paying customers' accounts and copy streams, so that in the likely chance that a gang was arrested and caught, he could blame innocent customers and have proof of this. Now, William was sentenced to four years for his role. Now, as for the leader, Mark Gold, police stormed his London flat in 2018, and Mark was found startled, sitting on his sofa in his pyjamas, looking in every which way direction. At the property, over 100 telly boxes were discovered, as well as bank transfers and receipts and privacy equipment. Now Mark was sentenced to 11 years for this crime. Is the sentence fair? Let me know in the comments. Stay safe. Safe.